Zotero for Mac, Creating Bibliographies. I have Zotero open, and I have Microsoft Word open, and I'm on the Zotero menu. I finished my paper. I finished putting in the in-text citations here, and I put the title for my bibliography, which in APA format is called References. And I've got my cursor ready to go in the spot where I want to start my bibliography. So what I'm going to do is go up to Add Edit Bibliography button. And there's my bibliography. Now you will still need to take a look and see if there are any errors before you turn it in. But you can see what a time saver this is. Now, the way that I just demonstrated creates a bibliography solely from the in-text citations that you've inserted. But sometimes you have sources that you don't need to put an in-text citation into your paper for, and you still need to get those into your bibliography. So what do you do? Now let's take out this bibliography and do another one. So I'm all set up still, ready to go. And I'm going to go back to Zotero. And here I am in the folder that I created for this paper. And I've got all of my sources, all of my items that I used right here. So all I have to do on a Mac is Command A. And I highlighted everything all at once. And when you right click on the highlighted items and choose Create Bibliography from Items, it will ask you what format, and it's already on the one we need. I'm going to do OK. And it comes back with this RTF is Rich Text Format. So don't let that worry you, just do Save. And I've done this before. Uh, this is the second time I've done this, so I'll do Replace. So now I can go back over to my paper, click on that, and click the Add Edit Bibliography button. And now I've got a bibliography that includes all the sources that I used. And again, you need to find and correct any errors. And here's one. Oh, this author's name has, it's all uppercase. <laughs> OK, so if you find an error like that, you have to correct it in Zotero, because that's where all of this information for your in-text citations and your bibliographies are coming from. So back to Zotero we go. And there is the error in this citation. So when I highlight just that one item, now I have the citation information over here. And I can go in and fix that. OK, that's better. Now, I fixed it here in Zotero, but it's still going to be wrong in my paper until I do the final steps. So back to my paper. And over here, I'm going to click Refresh. And that updates everything. And now the error has been corrected.